punished. Megan left out as Princess Kate secures Princess Diana's $1.6.5M jewelry hoard. The British royal family is renowned for its extensive and opulent jewelry collection, featuring priceless heirlooms and dazzling tiaras that have been passed down through generations. At the heart of this storied collection lies the legacy of Princess Diana, whose unique and iconic style cemented her status as a global fashion icon. When Diana married Prince Charles in 1981, she gained access to the royal family's breathtaking array of jewelry. Over the course of her marriage and after her divorce, Diana was frequently photographed wearing many of the family's most famous pieces, including the Cambridge lovers Not Tiara and the Sapphire and Diamond Suite. These jewels, now estimated to be worth a staggering 16.5 million pounds, were intended to be passed down through the generations. However, the distribution of Diana's jewelry after her tragic death in 1997 has been a source of tension and controversy within the royal family. Most notably, Diana's daughter-in-law, Meghan Markle, is reported to have felt outraged over not inheriting any of these precious heirlooms when she married Prince Harry in 2018. The reason for this perceived snub lies in the line of succession. As the wife of Prince William, who is second in line to the throne, Kate Middleton has been the primary recipient of Diana's most famous jewels. This includes the iconic sapphire and diamond engagement ring, as well as the lovers not tiara and the sapphire and diamond suite that Diana so often wore. In contrast, Meghan's position as the wife of Prince Harry, who is sixth in line to the throne, meant that she was not entitled to the same level of access to the royal family's heirlooms. While Meghan has been photographed wearing some of Diana's jewelry, such as her famous aquamarine ring, these pieces have been on loan rather than part of her personal collection. This perceived slight has only added to the ongoing tensions and drama that have plagued the royal family since Meghan and Harry's high-profile decision to step down as senior members in 2020. The couple's explosive interview with Oprah Winfrey, in which they leveled accusations of racism and a lack of support from the palace, has further strained their relationship with the rest of the royal family. Despite these tensions, the legacy of Princess Diana's jewelry collection remains a captivating and complex story. The jewels themselves are not just symbols of wealth and status, but also deeply personal mementos that reflect the tumultuous and often tragic life of the people's princess. One of the most iconic pieces in the collection is the Sapphire and Diamond Suite, which includes a stunning sapphire and diamond necklace, bracelet, and earrings. Diana was famously photographed wearing this set during a state visit to Australia in 1983, and the striking blue hue of the sapphires quickly became associated with her signature look. Another famous piece is the lover's knot tiara, which was a favorite of Diana's and is now regularly worn by Kate Middleton. This delicate, pearl-encrusted tiara was originally commissioned by Queen Mary in 1914 and has been a royal heirloom ever since.